Hello, I'm Liviu Balan and today I will show you how to ignore files globally in Git. So let's get started. First, as you can see here, if I type ls and git status, you will see that I'm having an empty git repository uh, and I'm on the master branch with nothing to commit and the, work, uh, the working directory is clean. What I want to achieve is to exclude some files from Git, but without creating or, or altering uh, a uh, Git ignore uh, file from uh, inside of my project. Uh, let's say I have a file, let's create a file with touch file dash one dot tmp. Now, if I use git status, the file uh, were created and is untracked. In order to ignore this, uh, you can create a file using vi.git ignore. And here you can place a set of rules uh, for files that uh, will be ignored by Git. Let's say that here I will uh, say that all the files that ends with TMP will be excluded. Right and quit. And now if I type git status, you will see that file-1.tmp isn't included in Git, isn't tracked, untracked. Um, but the problem is that uh, in order to achieve this, I will need to uh, add and commit this file uh, to my uh, current repository. I don't want to do, to do this because maybe I have an application on my current operating system which uh, generates this uh, TMP file. Maybe I have uh, another application that generates another files and uh, is relative to my current operating system. If uh, you work uh, on a big project and uh, your collaborators are using different operating systems, this is not useful for them. So is not useful to alter or create a git ignore file and uh, commit it uh, to the current repository. So uh, in order to exclude some files from git but uh, only my uh, only on my uh, current uh, user mm, I will remove the current git ignore using the rm uh, command so I will uh, remove the git ignore file hit enter use git status again and you will see that here uh, the file-1.tmp appears again as untracked file. Uh, what I will uh, do next is to create a git ignore file inside of my uh, home directory and here I will place the previous uh, rule to exclude the files that ends with uh, the tmp extension. Right and quit use git status again and you will see that again the file-1.tmp appears to be untracked. In order to tell git to uh, apply the rules from the file that I've previously created, I will have to use the git config command and here I will have to specify the option core uh, that uh, excludes file and here I will specify the that git ignore file that I've previously created. Now, if I hit the enter key and use git status again, <coughs> you will see that all the files that I will create aren't tracked. If I type ls, you will see file-1.tmp which is, is inside of my project, but git uh, doesn't uh, track these files. If I will create another file, let's say file-2.tmp and use ls and git status again, you will see that the file, both files are created, are inside of my current project, but aren't, but aren't tracked. Uh, if uh, you want to see what uh, git uh, put inside of my current config uh, file, you can type vi 
and inside of my current home directory use uh, git config hit enter and here you will see that after i uh, i've used this command with git config git uh, um, added inside of uh, this config file the excludes file and the location of the that git ignore which is uh, globally inside of my uh, which is uh, a global config for all the projects now if i switch the project let's say uh, to a wordpress uh, project of mine and hit enter now if i use this status again you will see that i'm on the master branch with nothing to commit type ls and now if i use touch command again and create here file dash one dot tmp use ls again you will see the file listed here file dash one dot tmp and now use git status again you will see that i'm on the master branch with nothing to commit and the working directory is clean so file dash one dot tmp isn't tracked so this is a technique that you can use in order to exclude <coughs> some files uh, from your git repository which is not dependent to your current working project uh, so this is how you ignore files globally in git if you want to learn more about git about web technologies you can check out my tutorials on youtube and also visit my website liveyoubalan.com thank you for watching bye bye